All right, first of all, if you're just hesitating or thinking about buying a headlamp for yourself or for a, uh, as a gift, think no more. It's one of the best tools, uh, gadgets, whatever you want to call it. It is very useful. Anytime you would have been using a flashlight, you could be using this and have both hands free. So whether you're camping, fishing, hiking, running, uh, working on the car, this is perfect. I used it to help when I was cleaning out the back of my refrigerator, couldn't remove the fridge, you know, couldn't get back to it. Needed both hands, this worked perfectly. I came back from fishing late night, had to still clean the fish. This worked amazing. Uh, I don't know what I would have done without it. And, um, and not only that, but I, you know, this sounds funny, but you'll find yourself trying to uh, find instances to use it because it's just a cool tool. It's a cool little uh, toy, call it what you want. Anyway, this, uh, I chose, I did a lot of research. I ended up choosing this model A because I think it looks pretty cool. It's all black or stylish. Some of them are green, yellow, whatever. If I was wearing this in public, um, you know, I chose not to uh, stand out. Uh, I don't know how widely accepted these are. Um, but anyway, this is pretty cool. The other thing that I um, appreciated about this model is it's got one single gripped button. There are a lot of models out there that have two buttons. The problem with that is A, the buttons are smaller, and B, um, you don't know, you, you get confused about which one you need to tap in order to turn on which light. This happens to have four different modes, but as you notice, um, this, going back to the button, it's quite large, which is good. Why and grip? Because in the winter, when you're wearing gloves or even when you're working on your car and you're wearing those, um, you know, plastic gloves, if it was not gripped, you'd slip right off and you wouldn't be able to find it. With the gloves, it's, it's no problem. This is very large. It's an easy click. You'll hear it click. And as I said, it's got four modes. It's got a, a floodlight, which encompasses the main spotlight and the other two lights. It's got the spotlight, which is obviously this, this only. And then it's got a, um, a red blinking light and a red viewing light. The red light, which I'll demonstrate now, Normally you just have to click four times. Uh, it's great for viewing uh, so that you don't lose your night vision and so that you can view maps, you can view gauges, dials, whatever it is. The red linking is obviously great for emergencies or for running. Um, I went through this with my wife. She used one because you don't always want to, you know, A, you don't want to waste the battery just running if you don't need it, but you do want cars and whoever else to be seeing you. So if you're walking your dog, um, as I said, running in a busy area, this works well and it won't use up your battery. Um, it's perfect size. I didn't want them. If you notice, some are really bulky, um, long, heavy. This only measures what? Just two and a half inches, uh, less than two and a half inches, about two and a quarter inches. And as far as depth, it is, well, let's call it eh, one and a quarter inches. This has the ability to rotate, um, I forget the exact number of angles, but it basically can do whatever you need it to do in terms of being straight out in front of you or angled down. So whatever project you're working on, you don't have to keep moving your head. The band is extremely comfortable. It's soft and as is, however, you know, they, this curvature here fits the forehead perfectly. It's very comfortable when you're just, you know, either running or at ease. The biggest complaint about this model that you'll notice on Amazon is that the strap slips out of the out of the unit, and sure enough, I noticed that too. I have it taped up now, but that <laughs> there's an easy fix. When you get the unit, there's a slit right here um, so that you can remove the headband, and here as well. And what happens is you put it on, you're off, take it off, it comes right out. I solved that problem really easily. You can see how I taped it here. All I did was take a quarter of an inch of electrical tape, slipped it around the this part of the band where it's open, tied it around, and you can't even see it now. There's a piece of tape on there. You can barely notice it. And you know what? Look at that. Try all you want, it's not coming out solved the problem perfectly no complaints I mean if you read the rest of the reviews everybody's very happy with it except for that one factor 
and it was solved in uh, under two minutes <laughs> with a couple pieces of electrical tape. Uh, what else? I will demonstrate uh, or show you a separate video of the view at night, how well it works. It's about 180 lumen and it goes arguably, or they say 30 meters, I'm sorry, 80 meters, which is about 240 feet. Um, I didn't measure exactly, but I'll tell you what, this is really, really bright. Some of the features it doesn't have, it doesn't have the autofocus, which I've been told is kind of useless or from the reviews that I've, I've read, um, it's not necessary. Uh, what else doesn't it have? It doesn't have a green light, which I really don't understand why people need a green light. <laughs> it's got the, you know, the four basic modes that you need and it's not rechargeable. It runs on three AAA batteries. Uh, which are contained right in here. By the way, this is really, it's a sturdy, heavy plastic. Other, I've, other models, they complain, uh, like the Energizer, like, I don't know if you can hear that click. But this is solid. When you, when you tilt this down, it's not going anywhere once you've placed it in the setting you want. Um, it's waterproof, IPX4, which means water resistance I should say because you can't submerge it but if you get caught in the rain or you drop it in the snow you're not going to have a problem this is so tightly on it's a good seal uh, but there's your three AAA batteries and as I say it's not rechargeable now with the rechargeable he headlamps you generally plug it into the headlamp itself and in most cases the battery is fixed inside the the unit meaning you can't access those batteries well over time rechargeable batteries lose their holding power meaning it's almost like your cell phone if you use it after a year and you charge it and discharge it multiple times the batteries no longer hold that charge so let's say they used to be able to run for 10 hours after a year it may only hold a charge for five hours and then if that's the case you either have to get a whole new unit or you have to start cutting up plastic and trying to access those batteries which is just a disaster uh, of a project and not worth your time so personally I prefer I looked for a model where I could just travel around with extra batteries in case I need to you know in case they run out I have to start looking for a charger um, and you know I don't have to worry about my batteries losing just you know discharging once they're up they're up I throw them away I replace them with new ones brand new fresh start um, Overall, you know, look, I could not be happier with this, uh, this unit. I, I love it. As I said, I look for instances to use it. Um, I even used it to, uh, inside the house to, my wife was sleeping. I got up early to go fishing. I started looking around my sock drawer uh, using this, this red lamp. It was perfect. Didn't wake her up at all. No complaints. Um, I couldn't be happier. If you have any questions, please, uh, write them uh, to me in the comment section. I will get back to you as soon as possible. There are no silly questions, uh, as you were once taught in school. Um, if you would like to learn a little bit more about it, uh, you can read the other reviews on Amazon, but um, I think we covered most of it here. If you have any questions, I also found the cheaper model on eBay. That was where I found it for less than $2. I've ordered it hasn't come yet. Um, I actually ordered a couple just in case because for two dollars these are great gifts and um, it's the exact identical model. Um, you can't lose. Anyway, good luck. Uh, if you'd like to read or subscribe, please do uh, by clicking the button below. You'll be uh, notified when we put out more reviews which will hopefully save you a lot of time. Uh, some money and a lot of frustration uh, going through all the reviews because we've done it for you. Anyway, good luck and enjoy. Thanks.